Okay, I'm going to give you a, a quick look at how I'm building my new little pumpkin pyramid, my smaller version. Um, what I did was I bought a 25 pack of incandescent lights. This was on sale and it was only $9, which is much cheaper than trying to buy separate sockets in line and putting something together yourself. So that made it real easy. So um, I've taken these plastic pumpkin pails and some of them had a hole and some of them didn't. I cut a little hole down here. This is one of these links that I cut off. Okay, so it comes out. Now, this one was an extra cord I had. What I did was I bought a bunch of six foot extension cords because they were only $2.20 at Home Depot. They were cheaper. Uh, it was almost $2.20 to buy just male plugs on their own, and then you would have to buy a lamp wire and put the whole thing together yourself. So it was cheaper to buy six foot extension cords and just cut off the female end of it. And then um, I used, yeah, sorry for my mess in here. I used these uh, shrink butt connectors, pull that out and you crimp it on here. And then you use a, a heat gun and it shrinks the outside tubing and makes a waterproof connection. So that's really all there is to it. Now there's a bulb in here with my cord coming out. What I did was I took the leftover corrugated plastic sheets from uh, my new faces that I built. I uh, hot glued two layers, one going horizontally, one going vertically to give it a little bit more rigidity. But I'm just trying to keep this very lightweight and simple. Um, so I'm going to be using these to attach the pumpkins to and um, stacking them up in my new little pumpkin pyramid. I'm gonna be using a couple of crates similar to this just to hold it up off the ground and to put the controller inside of. And that will be my new little pumpkin pyramid.